We're going to continue our little tour of different municipalities and um, bring you now also, via the magic of links, uh, the man who's responsible for green business infrastructure for Vestland County Municipality, which has done amazing things in terms of electrifying its transport systems, including ferries. I wish we had that in the UK. Uh, let me introduce you to Solve de Sonbu. Are you with us? Yes, there you are. Take it away, Solve. Yes, thank you. Yes, thank you. I would like to give you some examples on what we're doing in public transport. If we, travel, if we travel back in time, seven years ago, in 2016, there was only one electric car ferry in the whole world. Uh, but the same year, our politicians in Westland was quite brave. They went all in on electric ferries in the new contract tender for ferry operations in Hoydland County, the southern part of Westland. And they ordered 21 electric ferry for the operation. And today we have 30 battery electric ferries in operation in Westland, and we have 80 electric car ferries in the whole of Norway right now. And uh, over we cut emissions by at least 90% with this uh, tender. And uh, we are right in the ferry revolution. And uh, now we are also starting the fast passenger boat revolution. Uh, in the within the next Two years from 2024 to 2026, we will get a lot, several new electric fast passenger boats in uh, Westland County. The first one will be from Bergen to Aske, 100% electric. And uh, in the tender for uh, Song and uh, Norfjord, we say that they should at least cut 85% of the CO2 emissions and uh, we give bonus for more. So can be something between 85 or 800 percent and they will be in operation by 2026 and some of them traveled quite a lot long distance the ferries to song they have a sailing distance equaling 15 trips around the world each year and uh, some other interesting thing we have done is to actually rule that all taxes have to be zero emission taxes by March 24 and by 2026. It depends on two different areas in the Westland County. We got the permission by the state to have some new laws that uh, gave us as the public transport authority in the region this possibility. So this has been done in Oslo and it has been done in Westland. So to drive a taxi from March 2024, you have to have a zero emission taxi. And uh, we as a county council, we also back and support the transition uh, with chargers and infrastructure. Uh, we also had a quite interesting bus contract for the city center in Bergen. Uh, all the 112 buses in the con bus contract for Bergen center they are electric right now. Uh, but the best thing with this contract is that it was actually cheaper than the old diesel bus contract. So that's a new thing and it's a sign that uh, electric transport is maturing and we have a developed market. Uh, with ferries and the fast passenger boats, we pay more than the traditional diesel solution. We also have a 125 biogas buses running in the city. And uh, the bus passengers, they are back after COVID. And uh, we have, now we have more passengers than before COVID. Uh, I will also give you an example of the transition with the car market in uh, Bestland County. If you see the green lines here, they are the market share of electric, battery electric personal passenger cars and uh, it had more or less skyrocketed. If we travel 10 years ago, we hardly had any. We had one to two percent market share electric cars. But uh, last year's we had more than 90 percent. And uh, this month I expect the um, market share in the whole of Norway to be more than 90 percent. So it's moving in the right direction. 
Uh, we as a county council, we have also given grants for fast charging infrastructure in the county. Uh, we had given grants for more than 100 and 100 charging points with fast charging localities with more than several hundred charges. And um, before we started to support uh, charging infrastructure, we were at the national level in the county with market share of electric car. But after we had this uh, grant program, we have we have about seven percent more than the national market share each year, and uh, we are actually the region in the world with the highest market share of electric car and the highest share of electric of the total car stock. So that's that's quite fun. Uh, actually, our politicians they also want electric planes. Uh, we don't have uh, tenders. It's not part of the regional authority within uh, domestic aviation, but we support and work for it. And we want uh, zero emission transport both on land and sea and in the air. And uh, the result of this policy is that uh, the last four years we have more than uh, more than half the CO2 emissions from uh, public transport sector in uh, Westland County. And we are on. We are doing our best to keep on the good work. And uh, by 2030, we hope that all public transport in uh, the county will be without fossil fuel. So um, I think we also given some uh, public and uh, national interest in the project, and generally. The public is positive to the energy transition we have been doing. I think my time is up, so I stop here and looking forward to talk more to you. Thank you.